So I've created a copy of the category list file and um, that's just in case I make a mistake and, and need to start over so I don't have to go back and get that file. Um, so what we want to do here is we want a table that repeats the categories for each row and um, so in order to do that I, I want to have a second row. This row should not be set up as a header row like the first row and then in this left hand column I'm going to put the category name and in the right hand column I'm going to put in a delete button. So for now I'm just going to put in the word delete and, um, and then just leave it, as leave it at that and save the file. Um, now if you recall on that index page um, there's a list of the categories on the left. So if I wanted to I could go and look at the code for that and then just copy and paste the code and start with that. Um, so this is using the for each um, syntax that's on page 137 and then with this syntax it works a little bit better when you want to mix um, the code in with the PHP because you're not having to do a bunch of um, dot no notation and concatenation that sort of thing. So, um, so I'm just going to start with that and um, so I copied that and then I'm going back to my list here and then I'm, I need to go um, into my split view actually I'm sorry my code view and rather than try to integrate this in with the table right off the bat I'm just gonna see if I can get the category names to to um, echo and um, remember that when we were doing this on the other page we had them as list items and then there were links in there. Now we don't need links at this point so I can get rid of all the um, the link code and then I'll just leave in the li for now and um, so what is this doing? Well okay so for each um, category it's going to echo out the category name inside two li tags. So let's try it. So I'm going to save and hit an F12 and then I can see um, that I'm listing out the category names. So now what I want to do is I want those to show up in this column right here without the LIs. So how do I do that? Well I'm going to go back to Dreamweaver and um, first thing that you want to do is look at this table code and figure out what is it that you want to repeat. And um, what you want to repeat is this whole second row. So that means that I need to put the for each around that. So this first line goes before the second row right here and then to end the for each that goes at the end of the table row and then this bit we don't need the li's remember so I could just uh, delete those. Um, this is the part that spits out the category name so I can just cut that and stick it in this first column right there and then save and then let's just hit F12 again and now we're seeing the list of names in the left hand column and then the word delete in the right hand column.